Hi guys and welcome back to another vlog, welcome back to my channel. So today is Thursday and I just decided to head to Covent Garden as I haven't been for a while um, and partially because we're actually doing some housework so I wasn't able to basically do anything around the house, there was a lot of banging, a lot of dust, it was just giving me anxiety. So I decided to have a nice day and uh, I took my Nessa in the pram and we're gonna head to Covent Garden at least for for the morning, probably go around the shops and I would love to have a look what's new in Zara, perhaps try a few things on with you so you can guys have a look. I know these videos are popular and it's actually really nice to see, um, you know, when I personally enjoy these videos when people try it on, uh, maybe create some more content and just enjoy today. today. Yesterday was such a miserable day so hopefully today we're at least, you know, not gonna have a lot of rain it looks like it looks okay so maybe there's gonna be some drizzle maybe nothing but I want to be really positive because I was a little bit down yesterday um, and I would love guys if you hit the subscribe button if this is your sort of content and let's start the vlog see what I like, try to film and, and then hopefully nice trial session in the changing rooms. So first I'm going to try this stripey one. It's really easy, it will go with a lot of things. I think maybe medium. This dress is so chic, I just don't know the belt so... Yeah, I was first running. Yes, this is what I'm gonna try on, but probably not. Oh yes, love this card again. So large. Let me have a look at the other sizing. I'd say probably medium as well. This coat is stunning. I definitely don't need another coat, but I may try this on just for you guys. So you see, because it is a beautiful one. So I'll quickly show you what I'm actually wearing. Uh, hopefully you will hear me over the music. So this is actually all Zara with Converse shoes. I've got my Chanel bag and um, black coat. This is the first item. This is a coat in size medium. I love the color and the cut. I don't need another coat, but as I said, I wanted to show you what it looks on and I think it is a fabulous piece. Next up is this cardigan. I really really liked it, loved the texture, but I just thought like it's not working currently for my body shape. Um, this part, I love the color and I think it would look great on other people, so guys, you go and have a look, but it's a no for me for now. I'm also after some stripy jumper. I really like this one, but I would prefer perhaps if it was a little bit longer or if it had a zip, some sort of detail to give it some extra spice. Let me know guys what you think about this one. The price is actually quite good, so... Let's see. The last item is this white dress, but I absolutely adore these cowboy boots. I picked last minute just to wear it with some heels, and I'm seriously thinking about them. They're in special prices at the moment. That has been a bit of fail. <laughs> um, she basically started to cry, so I was really, really rushing. Um, the lights in there were absolutely horrific, so I'm not even sure of the quality. And because of the music, I'm going to do a voiceover rather than actually speaking in there. Because uh, I don't want to get copyrighted. Um, but also, every time I go into the changing rooms, I realize how unhappy I am now after birth. Uh, being one size bigger, obviously. <laughs> so, yeah, that is something to keep in mind. It always puts me off shopping. So the one thing I wanted to buy is one thing I don't need and I grabbed last minute just to have like heels with the dress because today I'm wearing Converse is the cowboy boots. 
and I loved them but didn't get them. I'm gonna think about them. I think they were in a special price like leather but then I have got at least two or three pair at home, probably three pairs of black cowboy boots so I don't need them. I just loved how they were done that they were like really wide around legs so I think they look really good with like shorts but then when I saw my legs I'm like oh girl with the shorts I'm not sure <laughs> so anyway at least the sun is shining uh, so happy days um, in general like I'm quite disappointed I'm, I'm I don't know the new collection in Zara is just not really grabbing me like I'm not loving it but let's see you know sometimes it can be you know a matter of weeks and then you know they have got amazing pieces which I fall in love but it could also be partially because I feel like nothing suits me at the moment anyway sun is shining I'm not gonna basically moan here that it was a bit of failure I'm gonna go and grab coffee I really fancy Starbucks as always there's so many good coffee shops but I just fancy Starbucks and um, she is back to sleep just because I'm on the move so obviously she wants to move and with Starbucks I can just obviously get a a takeaway and I can walk and head back home um, I think I'm not gonna go into the more shops today I just don't feel like it I'm gonna enjoy the sunshine maybe walk around the market but that's it pretty much just really nice quick trip better than uh, be in a house where there is major work and I'm pretty sure when I get home there's gonna be a lot of cleaning to do anyway upstairs but they put everything downstairs so I couldn't first first of all take the buggy and as soon as I stopped moving she started to cry so obviously she she wants the comfort of the movement of the buggy to sleep uh, so I'm gonna actually now walk uh, towards the station today is the strike so I'm only using really uh, just normal trains train line uh, I'm definitely staying away from <laughs> public transport when it comes to tube, so definitely not uh, getting any tube. And I want to take a walk. I'm trying to walk a lot now because I finally, after the C section, feel a little bit better. So let's say two and a half months after C section, I feel okay walking. Uh, so I'm trying to walk as much as I can and as a part of obviously exercise and fitness and trying to slowly getting there. But I'm thinking I need to slowly start some workout routine. Um, even if it's the, you know, some of the YouTube easier videos uh, because, yeah, exercise definitely will be very important <laughs> when it comes to getting back to shape. Hey guys, today is following day. And I totally had to stop vlogging yesterday because when I got home, I, I mentioned it, there was the electrician and the house was just covered in dust. So whatever my little one let me to do before I picked my other child from school, I was just basically non-stop like uh, trying to get rid of the dust and mopping the floor and hoovering. Um, but it's gonna go, yeah, there's gonna be more work done. Uh, so I didn't do like a big, big clean up. Um, um, but today I just quickly wanted to show you a couple of things and uh, just update with you. Well, first of all, I finally decided I need to do my uh, pedicure and manicure and I found, I think I got a mailer of SC nail varnishes. So I think I may try this orange one. And um, I got a really nice delivery from Laura Mercier. So I thought I'm gonna open it with you. Well, I've kind of opened it. So I know it's Laura Mercier, but I haven't looked at the content. Um, I really wanna create some content, but the electrician's coming soon. So I don't think it's just in between kind of Nessa and him, you know, being around. I probably won't be able to um, create much content. Um, I'm obsessed, by the way, with this Moroccan uh, treatment hair oil. The smell is incredible. Um, I probably need to get a trim of my hair um, uh, because obviously of the breastfeeding, it's even drier than normally. My hair is naturally very dry just because it's curly. Uh, but yeah, I'm trying to hydrate. I'm trying all different sorts of products, um, trying to use less heat as well. 
And another thing I wanted to show you is I've ordered this, um, I've shared it on my Instagram, so if you don't, guys don't follow me, there's a lot of like reels, fashion inspiration, everyday life. Um, um, I've ordered this Anin Bing, uh, I really love this, and I've got one of her caps, um, which is really simple, that says Anin Bing Paris. Um, you may probably know that I have got, I don't know why am I so blurry, yeah that's better. Let me show you a little bit further. So I think this is amazing. I think it will really go with my style, like sneakers, but even like boots with oversized blazers in the spring. I really love bucket hats. I've got a nice uh, Burberry one. And now I've got this edition, just again, something slightly different to spice up some of the outfits. You know, hats always fit, shoes always fit. Uh, so when you're not happy, as I mentioned yesterday with the body, um, I go for things like that, like accessories, just to spice things up. And let's have a look at some of the bits. I really want to create some content with this Laura Mercier stuff. There's actually loads, so let's have a look what they've sent me. So. This face illuminator is just so dreamy. I'm actually going to show you this one. And um, I'll try to link as well, um, whatever I kind of show, or at least some of it. I mean, look at this. This is so, so beautiful. And yeah, I don't know how long this vlog is gonna be, uh, but I think I'm gonna finish it here so it focuses a lot around Zara because Zara normally attracts new viewers. Uh, so I don't want to bore you with too much stuff and I'll probably get on with, um, oh wow, okay let's have a look, oh my god, I'm actually using this almost daily, so this is the translucent setting powder, um, I'm gonna take, take it out and just whatever kind of catches my attention. Um, the, this is the hydrating canvas primer. I actually have got all the primers, uh, so that's a top up for me. Eye pencil, and what else is this? Oh, light catcher. I haven't tried this one, so light catcher um, powder, perfect cream. This is really good. I've used this before. Tinted moisturizer, I also have this. And yes, the caviar mascara. And then I got some eye colors, but I wanted to look at the lipsticks because I'm very kind of lipstick obsessed person. Oh my God, this is beautiful. This is literally right up my street. I love colors, uh, color nudes and pinky nudes. And what is the other one? natural nude so that's gonna be beautiful and there's also some lip liners yeah very beautiful very natural this is exactly right up my street and then some lip liners and what is this one lip glazes i remember oops i did actually a while back um a dedicated tiktok i think it was during the first lockdown just with the lip glazers so they're lovely so thank you so much to Laura Mercier and I think I'm gonna guys finish the vlog here I will try to obviously link everything below uh, like what I've been wearing what I've been showing um, and I'm very grateful you guys if you got to this point uh, you watched until the end um, and I would love if you hit the subscribe button like the video and uh, hopefully come for the next one <laughs> when it's up so have a good day and I'll see you soon bye bye